Welcome everybody to the live stream. We're going to continue on with some Tomb Raider today. Oh, I didn't turn the camera on. Whoopsie. Professional streamer, by the way. Uh, hello, Razzle Dazzle. Hello, Coca-Cola, Loam Lore, 49er. How you guys doing today? Ah! It was better with just the black box. <laughs> uh... Yeah, so we're going to continue on with Tomb Raider today. Uh, we are pretty close to finishing it, I feel like, with the upgrade paths that we've been taking and, like, the size of the map and this and that. Uh, I did download Red Dead Redemption 2 last night. I downloaded it quite quickly. I was very surprised, honestly. Um, so I have symmetrical 100 or gigabit internet. So I can download at a maximum speed of around 100 megabytes per second. That's like with the TCP IP overhead and this and that going through routers and whatever. Like it's about 100 megabytes is like the cap, the absolute fastest I can download. And I've never downloaded anything that fast. Like everything that I've downloaded has been like, I think the fastest I've seen on Steam is around 60 megabytes, maybe. And that was like peak. Like, I hit that point and went back down. Red Dead Redemption 2 downloaded last night at about 92 to 95 megabytes per second. It was incredibly fast. Like, I was watching a live stream, downloading that, and the live stream kept stopping. Like, it was just chewing all the bandwidth straight to it. I was very impressed. I've never seen anything download that quickly before. Um... Death Viper, you're capped at 3.7 megabytes per second. Oh, dude, that's pretty slow. Uh, Lomo, you think it's about three more hours of the game until I finish Tomb Raider? Yeah, yeah, it feels like we're getting close to the end. Definitely. Uh, hello, Sabit, how you doing? So let's go ahead and uh, jump into this. Load it on up. But anyway, if we finish this game early enough and we got plenty of time left in the stream, we'll probably check out Red Dead Redemption right afterwards. Otherwise, if it's going to take us about, you know, halfway through our live stream for this, we'll probably wait for another day. We'll see how it goes. Uh, Tomb Raider. Play. You got a hundred megabit fiber. Yeah, believe it or not, uh, symmetrical gigabit is the reason why I even looked at Jacksonville in the first place <laughs> to move. I moved! I moved and I bought a house because of internet. True story. That's what happened. Now, I could have chosen different cities, but that's the main reason why Jacksonville was even on the list. Oh, well, let's turn off the monster cat. Uh, Alright, let's go. Death Viper says Germany has pretty bad internet government thought no one needed high speed internet and invested everything into cable TV. That sounds kind of like United States to be honest. Like United States really has terrible internet and most of it. There's some select places that actually has, you know, real good internet comparatively. The irony now is people watch TV over the internet. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Moving my gamepad around. Ben, you're loving the cap series? Nice, dude. Uh, you've been in New York City all week for onboarding for your new job, so you haven't been able to, to keep around. Uh, dude, that's understandable. Um, your friend in Cali is planning on moving out of state for better internet. You know what? I would move out of California as soon as I could right now, especially because of all of the stupid power outages and stuff that are going on there. Like, it is just way too populated, and the infrastructure is just so bad right now. I don't think California is really a place that I would want to live, at least for the next 20 years. Uh, where are we right now? Did we just finish a tomb? I'm trying to... 
Like, obviously we're in a cave, and I remember doing a tomb right before we ended the last stream, but I don't remember which way's out. What's this way? We did the buoy thing, right? The buoy going around and... Is that this? That's this right here. Okay, so we already did this. Uh, Betrayal of Blood, you are 62 years old today. Congratulations, dude. Happy birthday. It's not a tomb, it's a tomb. Seems legit. How do I. I want. How, I want. How do I. I can't. Is it really gonna make me get wet? Mmm. How do I get out of this? There we go. Found it. Wait. There's nothing even over here. What the actual? Oh, there's a thing right here. I couldn't see. It's dark. It's a Tuma? It's not a Tuma! What is this? Something we don't need. Uh, Storm Chaser, start the climb up to the research base. Is there anything else over here that we need? This GPS thing is a thing that we don't have, and that one's one that we don't have. That's where we're actually going, actually. Maybe we'll go down here and grab this GPS thing before we head off. I need to go south. I don't know which way south. I assume this way. Right? Is that the way I'm supposed to be going? No, but this way. About this way. <clears throat> All right, how close are we? It's over here still. It's like up on the the wreckage, I guess. There's a ladder. Nope, I passed it. Oh, it's right here. Sneaky. That was easy. Okay. Um, uh, there's this over here. Let's go north. One more over there. What? what? are you talking about? Oh, this right here. Oh. Uh -huh. Oh. Let's go grab this one, little guy. Since we're in this general area. Get on the ladder. Uh, hello, Yankee. Hey, Hypno. Been a while since I tuned in. Hope you're doing well. Have a great day. I am doing awesome. No, it looks like it's over here. Not over there, over here. No, still not there. Here? So somewhere in this building... I can't make that jump. Okay, stop messing with the crap. So somewhere in this building right here is a thing. Oh, this is like our camp. Don't want to talk to any of you. I just want to find this GPS thing. I passed it. Is it up above? Is it on the roof? Can't do a double jump off that. Oh. Right there. Okay. I kind of want to go see if we can get over to this thing. I don't know if we can or cannot. I don't see a way that this connects to anything. Maybe we just rope from here to here? Exactly, Coca-Cola, exactly. Those crabs are trying to crab dance. Uh, 
Or at least I was trying to convince him to crab dance. What are you doing? Suck it. It's a pretty cool way to die. I mean, if you're gonna die, you gotta do a backflip while you do it. Or is that a front flip? That might have been a front flip. Alright, am I still going the right way? I am not. This way? That way. Okay, let's see if we can get over here. So I'm assuming it's up on this tower thing. Now how does one get over there? So there's rock faces that looks like I can shoot into. <clears throat> Is there a place to attach a rope? Well, we don't... I mean, we can attach to that, but we don't have, like, a place to tie off to, and that's a problem. Oh, right here. Uh... I actually don't know if we can tie a rope off to this. We're gonna try it. Nope. So I don't know what that barrel is used for then. Um, are we supposed to use it to get up onto that waterfall or something? We look at the map. We're supposed to get here. So maybe there's a place to tie off on the other side. Or maybe this is just an area we're going to get to, like, if we follow over here, we go this way, then we can, like, walk around and get up here. I don't know. Let's climb up a little bit higher and see if there is, like, something that we can tie off to up here. There's definitely stuff that we missed. If nothing else, we're collecting stuff that we missed. Oop, that's wrong button. Hmm. Yep, not seeing anything that we uh, tie off to up here. So I'm guessing it's gotta be from over on that side. Okay. Well, let's go. Let's go to our waypoint. Let's do our thing. We'll continue on here. <clears throat> you got anything to say for yourself? I'm going to keep watch here. Reyes is working on the engine, and the others are getting some rest. We're going over this way. Oop, a thing. You know what? Didn't I get like gun parts? I'm sure I've rested at a at a campfire and like it automatically does that. Let's just take a look real quick though. So we have no skill points. We have some salvage. So we can do explosive arrow, stabilizing weight, penetrating arrows. I don't think we can upgrade anything right now. I don't think we have enough salvage. So 650, 300, and 650. So we still need quite a bit of salvage just for our bow. That's the only thing I really care about. Imagine going to a river soaking wet with a rifle, a shotgun, and a pistol. And a uh, competition bow. <laughs> but yeah. Taking guns into water? Not the best idea. Oh, I didn't press the button. I forgot you gotta do a, a second thing. Okay. Mm. 
Elevator go down the hole. That seems perfectly safe. Let's get on there. That seems like something that I want to write on. Oh, we can't actually write on it. Okay. Well, I saw that exposed uh, cliff face up there. So the thing, oh, do we just climb up the elevator thing? Oh yeah, there's white lines on it, right? Aha. There we go. Making us use all of our climbing tricks. Uh, we going around this? I think Laura's just gonna dance. Okay, I don't know where we're going. It looked like we're supposed to go around over here, but it won't let me go further this way. Do we go further around this way? I'm like super confused right now. I I'm trying to go around to the left, it like won't let me go anywhere. That's me jumping to the left, it like it won't let me go over there. It almost looks like we should be able to climb up like these metal pipes or something, but there's nothing for me to grab onto. Really weird. But yeah, it does look like I should be able to go like underneath these pipes and around the cliff face, right? Oh! Now it lets me? It wasn't letting me do that before. Okay. It was like stopping me, it wouldn't let me go. <clears throat> this is probably a part of the game where they're like, ah, players are never gonna get this far. Our tombs are too hard, so I didn't actually play test it. That's what I'm going to go with. Aha, here's a thing right here that we can get up over to our GPS that we wanted to get to. Oops. Hello, Saurus. A great place for some ventilation ducting. Okay, so we found a relic or a book, I guess. There is a GPS thing up here, but where? Other side. Right there, found it. Okay, so we got the things that we wanted to get. I don't know if there's any other reason to be up here. Oh yeah, actually it looks like we should be able to climb that and get onto those gondolas, right? Maybe? Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe that's just decoration. Let's go back to this. It says that we need to be... where? Oh, it does want us to be up there. And there is like a ladder. Hmm. How do we get up there then? 
Oh, I can climb up this water tower, it kind of looks like, huh? Maybe? No. Okay, I can climb this. Oh, then we get to the water tower. Got it. But of course, there is a uh, razor wire only on the easy to access part. Of course, it would be. Why wouldn't there be? The ladder gonna break on you? Classic platforming. All right, looks like we're gonna bring the gondolas closer. You know, we did leave like an explody thing down there somewhere. We didn't sweep all the mines. There is still one more. I wonder where that one was. Too late now. I'm sure this is going to be perfectly fine. Okay. 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 No, it's fine. It's fine. You landed in the water. It's fine. It's fine. I like how grabbing these gondolas and pulling them is like sliding them along the rope, the metal rope that they're like physically attached to, instead of like moving the entire rope around. Like when I pull this one, it like gets closer to us instead of like spinning us around the loop, you know what I mean? That's not really how these things work. They're not just free riding on the rope. They're like clamped onto the onto the the rope. So I guess you gotta wait for this thing to swing closer and jump at the last second. There we go. Oh. Th th there was a floaty thing there. So we're up here, but it looks like we're actually not supposed to be up here. It looks like we're supposed to be on that ramp down there and then jump up and grab the rope. No. Bad Lara. Just shotgun shells. Where's the? Th so obviously there's a place they want us to shoot with a shotgun to explode a door, right? <laughs> oh, Velsley. Seems kind of random just to give shotgun ammo. Wait, there's a ladder. Huh. Oh. We're just gonna climb up a little bit. Get this thing that we can jump over. Alright, that's fine. What the hell are we doing here? It's fucking Odie, is that too? Calm down. We got orders from the man. No one goes in or out. They kill anything that sets foot in there. <laughs> you been listening to the OMS crew? Yeah, they said some guys went in. Oh god! He's back up! 
Anybody else? Yeah. Who's gonna pay for what? Okay. No, I'm using the controller. Just for aiming, I'll put my hand off the controller onto the mouse. Just for aiming. Because the controller is hot garbage. Hashtag cheating? You mean hashtag actually being a gamer? It's called Pro Gamer Moves, all right? It's also called 200 IQ and also called you being jealous that you didn't think about doing it when you played this game. <laughs> All right. Oh, you just played with a keyboard and mouse? Yeah, aiming would be a heck of a lot easier that way. I wonder how this game actually plays as just keyboard and mouse game. Are we supposed to jump to that ladder? That doesn't seem very safe. Uh, all right, Laura, we're just gonna YOLO. You ready? All right, sure you're ready, let's go. YOLO! All right, we did it. Mm -hmm. Haven't we already been up into one of these things? I guess there's multiple. And the barrels also exploded. Somebody else came up here and stuck their finger in the barrel while they tried to shoot. What a bunch of dummies. <clears throat> uh, no betrayal blood, none of that. Hello, angry unicorn. So we're we just gonna drop it and try and grab it over here so we don't die. Oh, look at this, a GPS thing. I didn't even have to look for it, found it. How do I get to it? I want the GPS. I want the GPS thing. How do I get to it? Dude. Uh, Get me out of this. Okay, I found the button. How am I liking Tomb Raider? Uh, I'm liking it, actually. Surprisingly enough, it is a lot more engaging and a lot more interesting than I thought it was going to be. Uh, my dashboard just flashed and said that I'm offline. What the heck? I can see OBS. It says that I'm fine, but what? Time to refresh the old dashboard. Okay, okay. Alright, things look fine again. I don't know why I did that. As a content creator, when things like that happen, it's very unnerving. What's over here? Oh, this just gets us back to where we came in. There appears to be... Can we, like... Can we boop this? Get it booped. Hey, kitty kitty. Wanna come up and say hi? 
<laughs> yes, he does. I got my duster again. What a good kitty kitty you are. <laughs> it's so fluffy. He is super, super fluffy. He's a very needy cat. He's very needy. He wants me to like. Oh, oh, I got his tail. He wants to be upside down so he can need my beard. This is what he does when I stream. I don't know why he does it, but he does it, and it's adorable. And his claws are sharp. Needy or needy? Yes, exactly. You're such a good. You're such a good boy. All right, I think he's done. <laughs> there we go. He got his two minutes of attention. Now he'll leave us alone for five minutes and he'll be back. All right. All right, so let's continue on here. Drink a little coffee. You can wait, Laura, I'm taking a sip. Okay. What's over there? That looks like an artifact. How do I get to that artifact? They're just like teasing you, like, oh, what's over here? I bet you want that, don't ya? Oh. Freaking game devs. Alright. I'm sure there's a way around somewhere. Mm -hmm. That almost looks like a ladder, but then again, that almost looks like a conduit box. I don't know. Alright, let's continue on. That, oh, that's a fluorescent light. I was like, that looks like something we can climb onto, but no. Shit. Look at all those bodies. Keep it down. The only are here. Yeah. You want them to find us? Just shut up. Keep your eyes open for the girl. I can't. Now I should be able to. Laura Vision. I probably should have, but I didn't. Hey, look, it's a hand of Sauron. Kind of. That's just kind of floating there a little bit. I'm, I'm, it's, it's fine. It's meant to be like that. I mean, obviously it's meant to be like that, or the game devs wouldn't have done that, right? Am I right? Uh, Dr. Love John coming in with the 27 month resub. Welcome back, Dr. Love John. Thank you for the 27. There's a book. Oh, of course there's a book on a table. Every time there's a campfire, there's always like a thing next to it, isn't there? Right there. Soon after we discover the tomb. I don't read these books though. Readings for nerds. And also it just takes too long. It's too much dialogue. Not enough like it's too much dialogue looking at a screen. Ew. Look at that. There's another thing over there. I bet you want that, huh? Don't you, Lara?
What's this door? Hmm. Map updated points of interest revealed. Oh, did I miss a GPS and an artifact thing? Oh, we already know where that artifact thing is. The GPS is probably behind that door that we can't get. Press the button. I press the button. The sign said no outsider allowed in Japanese. Thank you for the translation. The two must be in the lower levels. Yeah, I assume that we're gonna get something that's gonna allow us to open up these like solid metal doors, huh? We it's a trampoline. What? How did Okay, I broke the game. <laughs> I have literally broken the game. <laughs> well now that we're out of bounds, where can we go? I've got to find a way down. I found a way down. Alright. Wait, that's how speedrunners do it? Is that a legitimate yeah, speedrunning strap? What the hell am I even doing? Did you hear that? I've got to find a way down. I, I feel like I should restart this game. I don't really want to sequence break. That's not what I'm trying to do. Wait. Oh, it did put me down lower. Crap. Mm. Can I reload from the last bonfire? I don't I don't want yeah, I don't want to like, you know, skip it. Last campsite, see, let's try this one. That's actually kind of funny that I was just playing around and I just discovered, I guess, what speedrunners use. The two must be in the lower levels. And you know that was discovered by somebody else just being like, "Wee, this is fun! <laughs> just like I was doing. So what does this button do? Oh, the elevator is jammed. Only one man would dare give me the raspberry. I need to go. Lone Star. Okay, so what's over? No. Okay, so we can't do anything. No. We can't climb up on this. Hey. I'm on the right track. Just need to figure out a way to drop the elevator with more force. Okay, so we're. Oh, now we're on the staircase. Now I can open this door. Okay, shortcut achieved.
Okay. Sucks to be that guy. Why are, there, why are there so many dead bodies in here that nobody has ever cleaned out? That just doesn't make sense. This place must smell amazing. It's up here. Oh, can't go any further. But we can, however... That's the wrong one. Oh, I can go up higher. Just need to loosen three more and that elevator will fall. So I saw there was like a crate back here. I guess it has to be on the third floor for me to climb up and get to it, so let's bring it down one. There's also this one that I got out of the burn thing. Let's bring this. There's also another crate right there. Oh my goodness. those other parts loose okay so it looks like if i get back there i won't be trapped that i can't just jump down so we need to do this again yeah. shotgun parts phoned Careful now. He did need some momentum and he did it manually just now. Wait, what? Just need to loosen three more on that elevator before. I'm trying to get these crates is what I'm doing. I'm not trying to like figure out the elevator. Dude, get me down here. Am I supposed to? Am I supposed to be like breaking these gears off? That's probably what I'm supposed to be doing. When I go back and I grab the thing, right? Let's go take a look at that. through there you're so stupid laura laura you're so stupid oh can we just jump up on this oh yeah, just jump up on it again. she went through like the hole up above so i assume we could just jump through this hole on all of them but apparently not Don't face palm me. I'll face palm you in the face. Now she's not gonna go through it. What the action. Dude, this game is fantastic. This game is great. Blast my way out of here. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm guessing me jumping through the hole like I did before is not the way we were supposed to go, huh? They look like a thing that we can hold on to. I guess that wasn't it. Is there anything else here that I'm like overseeing, I guess, missing? Okay, so there is like the craggy stone here. Oh, look at that. Ah, uh, I did it the easy way the first time. I'm gonna try and do it the easy way again if I can't. No, you know what? Nah, let's just do it this way. Let's just do it the intended path. Dude, this is a solid game, like zero bugs in it at all. Okay, just one more to go. Alright, so we did number four, we did number three. I guess there's number two that we need to do now. Which one? So it's on this side? Can I just pray from here? Okay. Now I gotta find out where the hole is for the first one. I guess it's this level here, huh? Number three. No? Well, let me pray it from here. Oh, there's an opening right there. Okay, so we need to bring that up to the next level. Drop down, go up the ladder, got it. annoyed or enjoying these puzzle sections i mean i'm more annoyed that i'm able to do things in an unintended way if like for instance when i went to go do the number four it allowed me to jump through this little service hole but that's not the way you're supposed to do it. it's inconsistent to do that that's what i like if i'm annoyed about anything it's the fact that it allowed me to do that in the first place Because that just made me waste a bunch of time trying to do it again and again, which you which you can't do, right? You're not supposed to do, anyway. This door's still stuck, huh? Yeah. Man. 
I'm sure they didn't hear that sound. The game looks really good, but it's very annoying that there are so many little things wrong. I mean, to be fair, there's really not that many things wrong. This is like the glitchiest section that we've seen so far, at least as far as I've seen. It is unfortunate. But like, that's the problem with puzzle games. If you make a puzzle and you're having the player try and figure out how to get through your puzzle, and then you have like unintended paths and glitches and things like that, how is a player supposed to know that that's not the way your puzzle is designed to go? I mean, more attention to detail in the puzzle sections, like, really would make this game a lot better. But again, we haven't seen too many, like, parts where it's just, like, absolutely ridiculous. Hmm, a max hair. Delicious. An arrow passing an inch from your head does not move for cover. Yeah, exactly. Like, how did he not hear the arrow? How did he not hear the arrow whizzing by? Is this something that we... We grenade? Nope. Something that we burn? Maybe? Almost looks promising, but no. No, not something that we burn either. It's right there. How do I get to it? Oh, there appears to be a cart here. Do we pull and make it smash into stuff? Can I do this? Nope. Okay. I can't interact with this cart. I can, however, get behind this. Research base complete, map found. Yeah, it won't let me interact with them. Hmm. Hello, Tom. <clears throat> Can someone tell me why when you limit stream download to 25 megabits a second, it only does like five megabits, but when you have no limit, it does 40. When you limit steam download. Uh, no, no, I really don't know how steam works. I feel like steam does like a torrent kind of thing. It just depends on the time of day. But honestly, I don't know if Steam does torrent at all. Oh, do we climb up here? Oh, we go back. Doesn't Steam do torrent? Isn't there like a way where you can help upload to other clients? I feel like maybe. So we did leave a GPS thing. Oh man, should I go back for this? I feel like we should go back. I feel like we have to go through this glitchy section and go back and do the thing. We're just going straight back, we are. Because it was brought up that I didn't do the Lara vision earlier when I probably could have to see if there's like a way pass. This right here, I don't know how to get to that door. Oh, wait, what? Does that mean I never rest at this bonfire? Combat shotgun complete. Now this back here. Oh, look at this. Is 
So that's that door. So I guess those are just one way door shortcut things. So the way we need to go is back over this way. All sorts of ammunition. Is there like an upper level we can get to? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so this was the first thing that we found. Tom dropping 200 bits. How am I doing? I'm doing well. Thank you for the 200 bits, Tom. Appreciate it. So, how do I get back here? Is this the thing from outside that I'm supposed to get to? I already tried grenading it. Pretty sure. Ah, oh, look at this right here. I'm sure it's fine. Were these gifts for the ancient rulers? Okay, did we... Oh, there's also a GPS thing here. Where is the GPS thing? Wouldn't it highlight? Hmm. Well, we got the thing. I jumped to that crag wall from that opening. I didn't see that there was a thing to jump to, but let's take a look. Oops. I don't know which crag wall you're talking about. Steam uses content servers and specifying a limitation can sometimes cause servers to not be used and thusly slow speed. Hmm. Are you talking about this right here? I think this is how we came down to this area. Like we came down from up above. It is possible the GPS is outside. I mean, I guess we could go up and look. Oh, I can't go up higher. Oh! Apparently I can... No. No, it looks like we can't go back up. It's weird how she was, like, putting it to the chain link fence. But then you can't, like, jump up and put it higher. Like, it seems like a chain link would be a perfect place to use that pick. Or whatever, but eh, whatever, it's fine. There we go, we got that thing. Now, I'm not really aiming for 100%, but like if we're in an area, I try and give it a try to get the things. But yeah, I'm not trying 100%. Like we've already missed some stuff previous that like it's a pain in the butt to go back and try and figure out how to get to these different areas that we've already been through. So pretty much once we go through an area, it's done. What's this door? 
Oh, okay. Well, we can take the stairs down, I guess. Wait, did we get the thing? Yeah, we did get the thing that was back here, right? Because we crawled up on that. Yeah. Is this it? Um. Okay. It's a big room with not a lot of stuff to do in it, it kind of looks like. I feel like we're going to get ambushed, though. These figures. Warriors. They're in Himiko's tomb. They protected her. Is this you? Were you some kind of general? You committed seppuku. So not Sudoku. ritual was corrupted. The priestess knew only death could save her and took her own life. Now the first and last queen lives a half-life, a soul in a decaying body. Her rage became the storms and would not stop while her soul is tied to this earth. My storm guard are sworn to protect her. They must continue, but I cannot. is trapped in a decaying body. That's what's causing the storms. To stop the storms, we need to destroy the body in the ritual chamber. How the hell am I going to convince the others? Okay. She's in the old tower. I've got to get out of here. I'm ready to stand and fight. Oh, but then I come. It totally looks like there's something to do over here, doesn't it? But I don't see a way up. Alright. Who else wants them? Time to die. It is time to die. Come on now. Oh. Alright. 
Aww. We good? I think we're good. So now I assume we can climb up here. Oh yeah. Yeah, she has to steal ancient artifacts out of tombs. She is, in fact, the Tomb Raider. Come on. So we don't know where anything is on the map yet, I guess. What? It's just satisfying watching people burn like that from the fire arrows. Watch out on the pier. Oh, fire. Fire. So it wants us to go that way, but what was it? Oh, I thought it sounded like an icon. But I want to collect my stuff. Oh, uh, one of the dudes fell down. I want to jump over there, but I'm sure there's an invis wall that'll stop me. So we're this way. Just death. Okay. Well, I guess it is napalm, but it, like with the fire arrows, it was doing the same thing, right? I think they're too far away for me to do anything. I pretty sure it wants me to go down there. I guess I killed them all? Reyes, you're hurt. Here. Thanks. Thanks. Seriously, I thought that was it for me. There's no sign of him. What happened? During the attack, Whitman took Sam and they disappeared. He's taken her back to Matthias. We should have listened. Fuck. I should have listened. So what's her next move? The boat's fixed now. We should get help. I bet they thought that too. Look, you were right about Whitman, You've but... You've seen the storms they talk at any craft that comes near. <sighs> there were scientists here during World War II, and they believed the storms were controlled by something in a ritual chamber near the monastery. Look, I don't have all the answers, but Sam being taken, I know it's linked. And if we try to leave here without understanding why, then we'll all die. Just like the pilots. Just like Roth. Look, whatever's happening here, Lara deserves a shot. 
We can't go back to their stronghold. It'd be suicide. They won't take her there. They'll take her to the ritual chamber. We can use this inlet to get closer. Look, I know you want to get home to your daughter. Believe me, I do. But the fight's not over yet. I'm not asking you to believe, Reyes. I'm asking you to trust. Okay. Let's get this thing in the water. Whenever you're ready right. to go, come aboard. Uh, are we ready to go? There is still this GPS thing over here that we did not get. Let's go get that GPS thing and then we'll hard out here. How about that? We want the right one? Okay. So it's gonna be over this way over here. Yeah, we're going the right way to get the GPS thing. Hopefully it's not up there. Is it just down here? Where is it? Is it on the side, maybe? It's not in the water. It's gotta be up! No! Actually, it's probably halfway up on this cliff right next to me, isn't it? It's probably like right there. Oh, come on. Now she just climbs over there freely. Let's go down. Because I think the GPS thing is probably down here. Is it not? Oh, it's further this way. Whoa! Maybe it's up at the top. Let's, we can go back up here real quick and we'll just check it out. It was weird earlier how I was having so much trouble getting over here. She just didn't want to go to the left at all. Oh, I missed this. Oh, it won't let me break the thing. Uh, wait. There it is. Okay. That's pretty much everything in this general area. Now, how do I get back down? Okay. Hundred percent of this game seems as logical as collecting all feathers in Assassin's Creed Two for those who have played it, they know the pain. I have not played it, so I don't know the pain. 
But yeah, I don't feel like going back and 100%ing. But if I, like I said, if I'm in an area, I'll try and get the items that are there. If I haven't, like, passed them already, you know what I mean? But... What's the shotgun got? Modified receiver... Extra damage. Hmm. I mean, I honestly don't really care about that. I'd rather just, like, get our bow all the way up. Arrows rig the grenade tips to explode on impact. Now, do you get unlimited grenades, or are those, like, the grenades that are still in your, um, in your assault rifle stash? It's probably the same ones, huh? Let's get the increased damage. Dude, we are five salvage shy. We're five salvage shy of penetrating people. I need to go find myself like a seagull or a boar or something. There we go. Now we got enough salvage. Killing that seagull is going to allow us to have more damage on our bow because reasons. Okay, now we can penetrate. I'm ready to get out of here. Lara, what do you expect to find in there? Do you really want to know? No, but you should tell me anyway. There's the soul of an ancient sun queen trapped in a dead body. Her rage is what's causing these storms. If we destroy the body, the storms will stop. Right. And why does Matthias want Sam? I don't know. And that's what's scaring me the most. Look, I know this is a crazy plan. Yeah, it is. But right now, crazy is all we got. So let's do this. No. I'll need you and Reyes to guard the main entrance while I go in after Sam. You're going in there alone? More people means more danger of being spotted. I need you here taking out as many of those bastards as you can. It won't just be the Solari either. There'll be others. Samurai, the Queen Stormguard. Look, anything that's not me or Sam, shoot it. My little bird. This isn't goodbye. I'm not gonna say goodbye. We got your back, Laura. This is not goodbye. I'm not gonna say goodbye. He wants to say goodbye. Let's be honest. All right. Now there's nothing on the map to show that we need anything. There's a campfire up ahead. All right. But won't let me press it. There it is. Who are these? The storm 
guard the monastery. They wait only to be introduced to their new queen by the one who brought her back to us. <sighs> of course, of course. I've encountered these archaic tribes before. <sighs> Let's get some awards, James. What is he doing? My name is Dr. James Whitman. I come to you in peace. I bring you your new queen. Oh, no. <clears throat> your queen. What is it, Jeff? Uh, your... Joel. My... No! 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 Ooh, that was a mistake. Okay then. What's up, dude? How you doing? Just hanging out? All right. I guess that's the only way across, right? All right. Let's go! Oh. Oh. Okay. We made it. I almost thought that was a landmine, so I purposely went to go stand on it, but it's just a shield. In we go. Hey, we got a skill point. And now I need to find a base camp. The storm guard still protecting their queen after all these years. Aha. Uh -huh. I like how Laura has infinite uh, napalm. Just all the napalm. I guess we burn that. I'm actually kind of surprised with all the arrows I shot over here that didn't just catch on fire automatically, but that's fine. Okay. Don't make a sound immediately shoot. Oh, come on. It's just if you make a sound, then you just die. You can't even fight your way out of it. Lame. Oh, we have to go back here and do this too. That's fun. Dude, how are these guys surviving? They didn't survive last time. That was weird. Like when I fought them the very first time, they all died pretty easily. This time they're just like super resistant to all my arrows. <laughs> weird. 
I don't like how there wasn't a checkpoint in this little area, though. There should have been a checkpoint over here. Hello, Sunset. I think you did forget to say good morning again, but that's fine. That's fine. You don't care about me. Can I go over here and see, or am I supposed to hang back? I want to know what's making this sound. Is it that big guy right there? Are we supposed to just like balance over to the other side with all these people? The dude, they're totally not gonna see us. They, yeah, they totally won't see us just walking, it's fine. Uh, how frequently do I play other games? Uh, you know. You can go to the info section of the live stream and you can see all the different games we've played and make that determination for yourself, I suppose. But pretty much when there is no, like, mod pack that's new, that's interesting, that I want to play on Twitch, we play other games. That's how it works. Yep. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing at this point. I guess we should use our Lara vision. So we're supposed to go up there. I feel like there's probably somewhere else we should be able to go. The thing is, I don't want to get instantly killed and then have to go through this whole thing again. Hmm. I don't see anywhere that's like... Oh, right here. I see. Again, I'm like trying to go a certain direction. The game like won't let me go that way. Inhuman roars. Ooh. Oh, I thought we were in a cutscene. That is not a cutscene. Why do they have the camera in front of her? This doesn't make sense.
Does not make sense. Let's just go ahead and put the camera in, a, in an angle that the player's not used to. That'll make it a lot more fun. Lol, you died. What'd you just say to me? <laughs> say that again! Okay, okay, this is not working. Boop. How can they be alive after all this time? I was gonna take him down with my melee weapon, but I guess you don't fight somebody with a pickaxe when they have a machete or a uh, katana or whatever it is weapon that they were using. I'm not sure what it was. Lomo, are you just making up words? talked about a soul in a decaying body being the cause of the storms. I know he must be talking about the last Sun Queen, but I don't understand what Himiko has to do with this. She was the first queen. Somehow Matthias thinks Sam. Let's do the dodge counter. And that can't be good. Damn you, women, you'll do anything. Nine out of ten, Lara's journals. Hello, Matza. How's it going? It's going pretty good today. It is going pretty good. We are making our way through Tomb Raider. I am enjoying the parts of this game that aren't, like, super buggy. I'm just auto-running at this point. Faked out with the cutscene again. Okay, we can go up there, and it does not appear we can do anything on this side. Actually, let's take a look at a map here. No. There's just ammo back there, but we don't need any ammo. Hmm. Maybe calling them a bastard wasn't a good idea. There's an exploding thing. Dude, that was a nice wind up there. You almost got me. Oh, 
You know what? Don't use that tone of voice with me, guy. Anybody else want some? Nobody else wants it. Oh, that guy kind of wants some. Hey, thanks for making a bridge. I can't see anything, too much fire. Okay. I need to get some of my arrows back, so let's do that real quick. Dude, those guys are giving me like 10 arrows each, and maybe 11, what the heck. So many arrows off these guys. Yeah, we're full up on all of our ammo. Where's that guy down here? Okay. Yeah, these guys are getting like 10 arrows each. Man, they're being so generous with the ammo. It's crazy. Then again, we're not playing on like hard difficulty. How did that guy survive? I don't know. Did that explosion kill this guy? He was pretty far away from it. That doesn't seem right. But okay, we'll go with it. Come on. I would say they're giving me so many arrows and now I'm just wasting them. Okay, that that's just not nice. That's just not even cool. Alright, can we can we just like take a second and talk about this? Yeah, that kind of hurts a little bit. We're just gonna hang out here for a second. BCS, thank you for resubscribing to the channel with Twitch Prime. I appreciate you, BCS. Thanks for your 14 months. 
Joshler, hello. I'm guessing from the music that was the last one. So to be fair, that fight was actually one of the more interesting fights that we've had in this game so far. Oh, boss fight time. Do I get rid of the camera for this cutscene? I guess not. Okay. Yeah, e easy boss fight. Hey, the door is auto closed on me. What the heck? Uh, do we have another bow upgrade that we can get now? No, it costs 650. Our pistol can use a high capacity mag if we got enough. Okay. Achievement unlocked, now we're getting serious. This Chinese earthenware is thousands of years old. Could they have visited this island before the rise of Yamatai? How how goes Laura Croft falling simulator? I mean, it's going pretty good. We've fallen quite a few times, so I'm pretty happy with that so far, to be honest. We never. a treasure map how do we get to the treasure map Seems like a place I want to walk around in. Achievement unlocked, archaeologist. I've seen similar artifacts on the Ban Jain site in Thailand. How did this get all the way to Yamatai? Not gonna lie, this place is pretty disgusting. Pretty foul. It's on the other side. I can't jump up there? What? So there's change on both sides. What's this one? Well, I'm just a book. I don't care. So there is this map thing. That might be like after we go up a level that I'm. All right, let's do this. Okay, we can't do that one. I guess we have to do the other one first. Seems legit. Would it just kill me if I jumped down there onto this thing? Probably. 
No, it does not. We're good. Now this ramp here, what is this? Go oh, there's a higher level thing. I found the thing we were looking for. Him? This looks so much like the Laura Croft games you remember from the 80s or 90s. When was the first Tomb Raider even made? Was it in the 80s? I honestly don't know. Oh, look at this. We're going to gong our way out of here, huh? Yeah, it looks like we're going to break through that wall there. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so that really wasn't that fun, but it's cool, I guess. Mm, so now I need to get over there. Am I gonna like jump onto this and then jump over there? I don't. Can I even jump onto these things? No. And now we fall down the bombus pit. It's fine. Tomb Raider one was ninety six. I see. What happens if we do it like this? That doesn't do anything. I wonder if we do it from up there, if that has any difference. Maybe it does. How's my cat today? Max is doing just fine. He's doing perfect. I'm sure I'm the very first person who's ever said that before. No. Okay, well, how do I get over there then? That is the question. Do I jump from this on top of that and then from there over? I don't think we can even jump on top of that. I think that's too far away. Max has competition now. Your brother got his kitten yesterday and it's just as cute as Max. I doubt it. I doubt it. I mean... I'm sure I'm, I'm sure you want it to be as cute as Max, but I doubt it is. How do I get over there? Ooh! Like, obviously, I can get onto that somehow, but I don't see how. All right, chat, backseat gaming. How do I get up there? He's not as fluffy as Max, you'll admit that, but he's super cute. I mean, you can't be super cute and not fluffy, all right? They just go hand in hand. I feel like I should be able to get on top of that cage and then jump over there, but I don't see how to do this. I don't see anywhere to like climb around the edges. I 
Unless I can just climb up this gate somehow and I'm just missing it? No, why don't we double jump up this gate? Can I pull that thing up higher? Um, okay. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Thank you. Well, let me do that. So I guess we have to do the other one. Well, what? Now, I wonder if we try and pull that up with that door closed, is that gonna do something for us? Because we couldn't close the door and then set it down on top. We can't climb this, can we? Hmm. This puzzle is very puzzling. But yeah, I admit, like, trying to close the gate and then set the thing on top of it would give you, like, a platform to jump up on, but it didn't seem like I wanted to do that. We'll try again. I mean, I don't know what else. These are the only things we can interact with in this room. Oh! Maybe I wasn't spamming the button. Maybe that's the problem. Okay, I'm, I just derped. Okay, we try again. There we go. That was easy. Easy. But now how do we get up there? <laughs> now that we've done this. Let me try to jump it back on here. Maybe there is like some kind of a, a Laura vision hint. Did I just like fail the jump before? I can't make that jump. So what else am I missing? Swing it? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. I guess I need to be up there when I do that and then jump onto it. Okay. I gotta be up higher? I know you can, Laura. Easy! And they act like that was even supposed to be a challenge? Pfft. Hello, free slave. The 
young queens. First try. Fire ritual where the queen chooses her successor. The chosen priestess enters the monastery. And she's given your power and becomes the new queen. Wait a minute. Many have given up their souls willingly for this gift. Now the first and last queen lives a half-life. A soul in a decaying body. Vessels. It's not transferring power. It's transferring a soul. All these queens, they're all... You, Himiko. First and last. Oh God. And now you want Sam. Well, you're not getting her. Yeah, you tell that statue. Sam, a vessel for the Queen's soul. I've got to stop this madness. Mm. Boop. What the heck? The door just... Nice game physics? I mean, this door has got to weigh like, you know, three, four, ten tons. And it just like swings freely like that. What the heck? Okay. That's fine. It's meant to do that. So we have two paths. Oh, there's a thing in here. Uh, hello, Zaf and Ali. How are you? You are late. That's going on your permanent record, by the way. I'm making a note of it right now. Don't be tardy again. Otherwise, I'm going to put you into, into detention. You know, I do have to say, I like as we progress in the game, like, not only is Laura getting more cut up, but her shirt is, like, taking a bunch of damage and getting holes and rips in it. It's just a slight attention to detail. I think that's kind of cool. Like, I'm pretty sure her clothing was brand new looking when we first started this adventure. Oh, there's a thing right here. The Satsuma porcelain vase. Probably early Edo period. The chasm ziggurats. Mm -hmm. No, no, please. Why are you doing this, Messiah? Do you think that you're the hero, Lara? Yeah. Everything I've done, I did to survive. How many lives have you taken to do the same? There are no heroes here. <laughs> Survivors. Himiko's dangerous, Mazias. She's angry, she's vengeful, and she has real power. Ew. A mere mortal for a queen. A good trade for our friends. 
freedom, I say! another way up probably the path that's you know right here with a lion turning into and all of that i'm sure i mean there's a path right here way up. what happens if i just jump this do i die immediately oh there's an invisible wall okay that's fine there must be another way up No, I missed. Boop. Easy. I guess we're gonna jump over onto this, yeah. Is there any artifacts or treasures? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so now that we are here... No? Lara, 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 what are you doing, Lara? What's she doing? Obviously, you jumped to the left. Go up. Go on. You can do it. Well, we are going to gong the door. Actually, you know what? I think we have to do it this way. We don't do death counters here. We've tried doing death counters in the past on games like Dark Souls or whatever. And then the chat is just filled with like deaths, especially if I'm on a boss fight or something challenging. And it just gets frustrating for me to look over at chat and see nothing but like numbers where people are counting death. No. We don't do that. And I'm not gonna update a death counter every single time either. It's just... It's tedious, it's not fun. So the only thing I can see is that bell up there. Are we gonna like rope the bell onto this? Is that what we're doing? I guess that's what we're doing. Those bastards are heading your way. We did everything we could to slow them down. Thanks, Reyes. Get to the boat. If I'm not back... We're not leaving without you. We'll be waiting. But what if she never comes back? <laughs> that was a conveniently placed craggy wall that we can grab onto. Whoever put that wall here, good job. Sure, I'm sure, you, I'm sure this is structurally sound. Let's go ahead and tie off to that. I'm sure that's fine. We missing any artifacts or anything? No. Oh, 
I'm sure you were, uh... Oh, I'm sure you had good intentions for suggesting it, but I'm just telling you, like, we've tried it in the past, and it just... It's very frustrating for me, anyway. Not a fan of death counters. gonna lie this looks a little cold I don't appreciate how cold this looks If you want to count on your own and secretly judge my performance, that's fine. Just don't post it in chat or anything. Italian Stallion coming in with a resub. Why am I on this? I don't want to be on that. Real nasty lack. We good? Dude, hold stop hold on, I'll be up there in a minute. I'm just looting stuff. Um, I tell you something, thank you for the, uh, the message too. Appreciate the 38 months, dude. Kill this guy. I didn't kill him because I'm using a freaking controller. Let me switch back to use a mouse and do this properly. Did 
do. Now we gotta do two shield guys. Oh, that's fun. Oh, that was a terrible execution move. I want my salvage back for unlocking that. Oh, I can't jump up this thing? Okay. Well, you died. Um, does it really expect me to jump? YOLO! YOLO! Dude, check out the sky. It's like make me auto move, weird. Uh oh, it's big boy. So if I get next to, um... Okay, so this is gonna be easy. I just shoot him in the back. Boop! This guy. Are there just always gonna be two ads now? Ow. Ow.
I can't see what I'm doing. Take, 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 Scramble that brain a little bit. Dude, there's still an ad. Why are you resting? There was still an ad. Somebody trying to kill you. I guess the ad just magically disappeared. Okay, that's cool. Do I not get to loot the big boy? All right, here it is. Yeah, that's right. Give me that plus 90 solage. I guess we're... Where are we going? We're going this way? I have no idea where we're going right now. This way. Okay, so that doesn't work. I guess we're not in a cutscene. Just a bunch of QTEs. X X X X X X X X X X X. Just going matrix on this guy. I mean, that's a pretty cool way to go out. Sal. Oh, Sam. Thank God. Uh, uh, what's happening? I'm here. You're safe now. It's okay. It's okay. You saved me. I knew you would. I made you a promise. Let's get you home. There is no Sam, only Zool. Sam! She did it. Feed the chunk! 29 months, thank you, dude! Thanks for dropping the Twitch Prime! I think she's going to be okay. What happened up there? It's over. We can go now. All right, let's get the hell out of here. I've been so blind, so naive. For years, I resented my father, doubted him like the rest. But he was right about so much. 
I just wish I could tell him that now. There are so many mysteries that I once dismissed as mere stories, but the line between our myths and truth is fragile and blurry. I need to find answers. I must understand. Achievement unlocked, a survivor is born. Anything? Mm. Don't really know what happened to you on that island. Judging from those wounds and that look in your eyes, I'm just I don't want to know. Anyway, we'll be home soon. I'm not going home. I'm not going home, I'm going into the sequel. Dude, there's a lot of XP. We hope you have enjoyed playing Tomb Raider. We have worked our hardest to bring you the best game we could possibly make. Try harder next time. Thank you for taking the time to complete our game. You're welcome. You're welcome. But try harder next time. That was actually a pretty enjoyable game. Um, the floating flashlight, the floaty rock, those are fine. The elevator where I was like pretending it was a trampoline and then I fell through and I broke the game, like breaking the sequence and then being able to jump through the little thing where I'm not supposed to jump through and there's just like a bunch of little things that kind of irked me but like for the most part I'd say 95% of this game was pretty solid I would say this game was pretty solid it's definitely worth the $20 on Steam that I paid for it I don't know how I'd feel about this game had I paid $60 for it uh, it might have been one of those games like back in the day had I played it before I started like doing YouTube and streaming and stuff, if I had played this game, I probably would have done another playthrough and tried 100% it, but meh. Yeah, Dutch Savage, I saw what you said. I'm um, glad you're liking the YouTube series. How many games have photos in their credits? That's a good point. Not too many. Not too many. All right. Is there like, is this one of those games where I should wait till the very end and they give you a teaser for the next game? Or is there nothing at the end of the credits? Or is it like one of the good games where you skip the credits and then it gives you a little teaser anyway afterwards? Plot twist, a photo of Max shows up. I'm just going to press a button. Be too close. Congratulations, you completed the story with an overall game completion of 86. You may return to the island by selecting continue in order to complete any unfinished activities. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. I don't really... Like, we never found all the red cap mushrooms. We still left one of the minesweeper things. We didn't collect all the GPS things. I think we're good. I think... I think we're good on the Tomb Raider for now. 